Hey guys, it's CD, and it's November. Now, I've had a lot of junk happen throughout November so far. Um, I'm not going to talk about it, because my goal is to try to um, talk less about drama and stress on my YouTube channel, because that's not fun. That's not fun for anybody. Excuse my voice, still going through the puberty and everything. Um, but November, um, I just realized is a special month for me because this month marks my one year on testosterone. So that means I have been taking testosterone for one year now. And I actually am getting my dosage upped again this month. So that'll be exciting. They're moving. Oh, what is happening up here? Um, they're, <laughs> they're upping my dosage from 40 milligrams to... This hair just wants to be a star today. I'm sorry. Um, you know, um, what? Okay, hold on. I'll be right back. Hang on. Okay, I'm back. Did I get it? Yep, I got it. It couldn't behave, so I cut it off. I was just like, I was just like, fuck it. And I cut it off. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm getting my dosage up from 40 milligrams to I think 50 milligrams. I'm not sure. I didn't ask my doctor. I should have. It skipped my mind, though, so I didn't think about it. Um, so yay, one year on testosterone. Fantastic. Um, I'm still feeling pretty good, still feeling pretty confident about my decision to do this, to transition. Uh, so, so far, so good. Um, besides my voice getting deeper, I've started sprouting some straggle little black hairs all around my face that you can't see because they're just little itty bitty black hairs. Um, hair is getting darker and thicker on my chest and else other places, um, like legs, thighs, stomach, whatever. Um... And then obviously the voice is deepening. This is like my normal talking voice now, um, except when I go to work, I have to talk like this and I have to raise my voice up, um, which still doesn't sound all that convincing, but whatever. Um, breasts are shrinking slowly and that's fine. I'm actually not too worried about it. Um, I'm trying to stay in shape. I'm still gaining some weight, but since I work as a dancer, I get to uh, work it off and I don't get fat which is good. I'm not, you know, that was my doctor's concern. She was concerned I was going to get fat because that does happen to some trans people when they start taking testosterone and they gain a lot of weight, but they don't do anything to work it off or maintain it. So they just end up becoming chubby and that's not good for you. Um, so yeah, all that's happening. Um, I have money for internet now, so I will be getting internet. Fuck it. Um, I have gone too long without internet. I'm sick of uploading from my phone because it sucks. Um, so I'm going to get internet and I want, and I'm going to be, uh, stopping, I'm going to be, I'm, I'm going to be done pole dancing by the end of December. Hopefully that is my goal. Um, because obviously I can't keep doing this if I keep transitioning. Um, so yeah. Yay. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? Um, um, ju -ju -ju. I think that's all I wanted to talk about. Um, if you're wondering where I got this super cute shirt, it's covered in, like, uh, like, cereal and, like, soup and stuff and other junk. If you're wondering where I got this shirt, I got it off. I'm not sponsored, by the way, but I wanted to tell you guys anyways. Um, I got it off an app called Yes Style. Y-E-S-S-T-Y-L-E. And it's a app on the Google Plus Store. I know it's available for Android. I don't... It's probably available for iPhone. If it's available for Android, probably available for iPhone. Um, but they got, they have a lot of cute clothes that are from like Korea, China, there was even some stuff from Australia I saw, but lots of cute, um, oriental clothes or fashionista type stuff. Um, so if you want to go check it out, you can, um, it's basically like an Amazon or eBay, but specifically catered to, um, like Asian stuff and some stuff from like Australia and Britain, like I said. Um, they don't have, they have baby clothes, they have stationery. 
they have women's wear, men's wear, they have um, cologne, deodorant, brushes, shoes, all this stuff, hats, hoodies, tennis shoes, all this stuff. They have a bunch of crap to look through so you can go on there. I'm sure you could find some really nice gifts for people or stuff for yourself. I like to shop for myself. Um, I haven't been able to lately, but once I uh, once I get a stable source of income, hopefully I will. Again, not sponsored, but wanted to share. Uh, I don't have any kind of code or anything for you guys. Sorry. Um, a lot of their stuff isn't really all that expensive anyways. And even if it is, it's really cool stuff. Uh, like I said, this shirt, I really like it. It's a comfortable material, it's soft, and I like the design. It's simple and cute. Um, so yeah, that's all I wanted to talk about. Uh, I hope you guys are having a good November. I hope you guys have a good Thanksgiving. Again, still trying to get my upload schedule in order. I have... I cleaned up a little bit. It's dark back there, so you can't see anything. I cleaned up a little bit. I'm still not ready to show it off because it's um, still messy. Um, it's mostly lots of papers and binders all over the floor with little knickknacks here and there. Um, I did pick up some trash and everything to try to clean up a little uh, did dishes and everything. Um, so yeah, that's it. Uh, hopefully next time I do a video, this will all be cleaned up or at least more tidy. So I don't feel ashamed for showing it. And then I can give like a proper home tour. I've been living here almost a year now and I still haven't done a proper apartment tour. Um, so yeah, um, what else was I going to say? Okay. Um, so I eventually I'll get to do this, but I can't right now, but eventually when I get around to editing this video or not editing the video, but editing the description and everything and the tags, um, I will pop a link down in the description to my red bubble and to another red bubble that me and a friend are collaborating on. Um, it's mostly weird stuff me and him are working on. It's like monsters and gross stuff like that. Um, he does a lot of the designs and I do a lot of the touch up, clean up digital stuff for it. Um, and then his girlfriend is kind of like our marketing, <laughs> our marketing girl. So she, uh, uh, both of them will like look at the designs and they decide how it should look, how big it should be, blah. Um, so I'll pop those links down in the description when I'm able to, um, if you want to ever check it out. I do upload stuff up on my Redbubble. Some of it's really the gorilla, some of it's not. Um, a lot of the money I make from Redbubble will go will go to like um, a special little account in my bank to start saving up for top surgery. Um, so yeah, um, I think, don't know what else I should pop a link for. I guess I could. Uh, yeah, I guess I could pop down my Twitter. I don't know. It's it's mostly going to be the red bubble because I'm trying to, like, advertise that. Okay. Um, so I'll do that when I can. Uh, that way you guys... And I'll... I will... I'll post a link to my Twitter and I'll post a link to his Twitter as well. That way you can go follow him if you want. Um, sorry, I'm picking... Picking at acne. I'm gross. I know. I'm a... I'm a picker. Whenever I feel something I can pick at, I pick at it. Okay, that's enough. That's a totally different story, though. <laughs> not even a story. That's something I need to explain. Okay, so thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you guys have any questions or concerns or comments, you know, leave them down in the in the comment section, <laughs> and I will get to them. Um, I'm usually pretty quick. I'm usually pretty good about answering questions and stuff like that. If you have anything specific you want me to talk about, anything. I love talking about shit that's, like, gorillas related. Um, I have not had a chance to sit down and look at their... The G-Shock stuff. I saw one, but I haven't got to see the... I saw the second one, but I haven't seen the first part or the third part yet. Um, so I haven't had... I don't have any theories on that yet. Um... Or not theories, but I don't have anything to say about it just yet. But if there's anything you want me to talk about or whatever, if you want to ask me, like, hey, have you seen this or this and i say no tell me about it um or whatever um so if you if you like this video and you want to support remember to like comment subscribe or hit the bell for notifications so you know when i upload which is not often and i'm sorry um i think my next sorry um uh, my next video i'm probably going to end up talking about this new backer i got um, I just ordered it, I already opened it, and wore it, and blah, but I'm going to talk about it anyways, because it is an important part of a trans guy's 
aesthetics or stuff for trans guys to wear supplies and everything and i will even talk about the website i bought it off of that way if you have any friends who are um who are trans guys or trans mask individuals and they want to buy binders and other stuff like that i'll tell you um or if uh if you have any questions about transgender individuals i'd be happy to answer i'm not a very like naggy person when it comes to that kind of thing i understand that there are people who don't understand and it, i am perfectly fine with talking about it um i don't get I don't get dysphoria as much as other people do. I don't harp at people about my pronouns or anything. So I'm really chill about it. So as long as you are not being hateful or anything about it, I will be happy to answer questions or comments, or whatever. So thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, you'll see me, but I won't see you in the next video. Bye.